Hi, I'm Linda, and this coaching clip is all about compassion. I call it the Compassion Project, based on the work of Harry Palmer in his book called Resurfacing. So I might want to start by inviting you to reflect on what is compassion. So compassion literally means to suffer together. So the idea of compassion is that it's a feeling that arises when you're confronted with another person's suffering and you feel motivated to want to relieve that person's suffering. And that includes yourself. So that's compassion. So this practice isn't too complicated. Um, you're invited to practice this with people that you don't know from afar, unobtrusively. Um, maybe even walking down the street as a person passes you. And the idea is there are five statements that you silently repeat to yourself as you place your attention on this person. So I'll go through the five statements and uh, allow them to settle into you uh, just a little bit. So we'll pause between each statement before we move on. So the first statement, as you place your attention on a person in a room, in a mall, on the street, just like me, this person is seeking some happiness in their life. Just like me, this person is seeking some happiness in their life. And the second statement, just like me, this person is trying to avoid suffering in their life. Just like me, this person is trying to avoid suffering in their life. And the third statement, just like me, this person has known sadness, loneliness, and despair. Just like me, this person has known sadness, loneliness, and despair. And the fourth statement, just like me, this person is seeking to fulfill their needs. Just like me, this person is seeking to fulfill their needs. And the final statement, just like me, this person is learning about life. Just like me, this person is learning about life. So you're welcome to practice this with family members as well and even practice it together, knowing that you're practicing it with your loved ones. And at the end of your day or the end of a week of working with this practice, you might like to take a little time to reflect on, on what you're observing. What are you learning about compassion? What are you learning about yourself, your relationships? in the world around you through doing this practice. And how will you integrate what you're learning and this increased awareness that you have about compassion into your life? So you're welcome to go to my website, lindapedley.com, where you'll find in the blog a handout of this practice. So if you haven't remembered the statements, don't worry about it. You can go to my blog on my website and you'll find a handout of the practice that you can print and take with you. Have a brilliant, compassionate day.